tackle for uh, for Saturday's game. Um, first Sorry. of all, yeah, it's okay. You can come, you can come as close as you want. If you're, uh, we can get right up close and personal. Um, you got you know, <laughs> you can, you want to see yourself? No. Um, yeah, we we kind of saw you as Tyler's backup at left tackle. Mm -hmm. um, seems like there, there was a switch when Tyler went down to right tackle. Did How much experience have you had playing right tackle and working at that position? Uh, I've thing? played guard and tackle all of high school, and then when I got here, I'd just been all over the place. So, I mean, the only thing that's different is you switch up your footwork, and other than that, it's the complete same position. Zip. And you don't have Marcus's blind side. <laughs> Less pressure then? Uh, yeah, but I mean, at the same time, you still want to perform just as well as if you're on the left side. How long have you been working at right tackle? Was that the uh, We've right? been switching around all spring. I played guard in the spring. I played tackle in the spring. I played guard in camp. I played tackle in guard in camp. I just, it, I can play everywhere but center. So the footwork switching from tackle to tackle is pretty much fifty percent or opposite, direct mm -hmm. opposite. How much of a challenge is it to switch over? Honestly, it's not. It's not too big of. It's not that hard. You just have to learn how to kick, kick slide, which is the pass set right. the other way. But other than that, it's really not that difficult. Now those drills you work on anyway. I mean, you work yeah. on kick sliding both yeah, sides. Wood, wood makes us do both. Yeah. He wants all of us to be able to play Universal. pretty much everywhere. I learned. I tried to learn how to snap, and it was just terrifying. <laughs> Wasn't no good. center for you. No. Okay. <laughs> that didn't go well. <laughs> no, not at all. I uh, had to do a scrimmage, and I tried snapping, and I think I rolled the ball six times, <laughs> and uh, they never let me snap again. So <laughs> it's kind of heartbroken. Now this will be your first start, correct? Yeah. How excited are you? I'm really excited. Uh, you know, I haven't started a game in three years and just been thinking about the last couple of days and how long it's been. And I've been working really hard and uh, I'm just excited to get out there finally. The nerves at all leading up to the release of the depth chart? Or are you confident? No, nah, I mean, with as hard as I, I worked and put my mind to things in the off season, um, I was pretty confident. Even if I wouldn't have started, I know I would have been contributing a lot because you know how we rotate guys. Um, but it was just, it was a lot better of a feeling once I found out I was starting. Obviously, it would have been a lot better if Tyler was completely healthy still, but I'm um, going to do my best. What do you see at the, at the right guard spot right now? It's, it's Jake or Cameron. Um, um, look, I mean, they're both great players. They're the same. Well, Cameron was a true freshman, but um, Jake got a lot better. He was, yeah. he's just, I mean, he's huge. And he was, he was working out with me the whole offseason, and he got – a lot bigger and a lot faster and I mean I really don't see anyone missing a beat when either of them are in so it's uh it's nice to have guys that can rotate. I imagine Jake probably improved a lot Cameron started by the mm -hmm. end of last year as a true freshman they're, like you said they're the same year mm -hmm. they came in together Jake was red shirting yeah. how much has Jake grown since last season? A lot mainly in his strength and then just knowledge of the playbook um, and it's it's really good to see him out there just hitting some dudes pretty pretty hard and same with cam and uh i mean we need that with because we got hamani he's gigantic so we need we need some of that size inside and i think we will definitely have it with jake or cameron there it doesn't really matter who speaking of size the defensive line mm -hmm. like your team that you guys go up against every day is massive yeah. um what's it like going against them in practice? it's not exactly the most fun but i mean it definitely it definitely gets you to be a lot better of a player especially when you're going against eric and deforest um they've helped me get so much better and just knowing that i can block them it again that's pretty much what's been boosting my confidence over the last few months thanks thanks yeah.